So today we are going to make some simple stewed apples and hopefully you will enjoy them. Watch the recipe and how we made it. So first we are going to peel the apples and cut them into small pieces. Okay, so we've cut and peeled the apples and put them in a pot full of water and now we are going to put it on the stove. So oh, the apples have just started to boil and in about half an hour they should be ready. We changed the pot because the other one was a bit too small for all our apples but now that it's been boiling we're going to add in the sugar. All of the sugar all in. There we are. Nice. It's okay. And we're going to mix it bubbling. Okay, and we're also going to add the cinnamon. And we're going to mix that again. Okay, we've added the ingredients. Now it's boiling nicely. We need to let it boil for the next 30 minutes. And it should be ready. If not, just cook them until they turn nice brown color and soggy enough. Okay, and since we like sweet things, we're going to add one more tablespoon of sugar. Okay, they have been cooking for about 25 minutes and they are nice and brown. We'll just give it an extra five minutes so that they can get even softer. And then We'll show you the next step. Okay, they're ready. We're just going to put it in a bowl and put it on the windowsill so it can cool down and make some nice stewed apples for us to eat. Okay, we've put it on the windowsill so it can cool. Just look at it. Mmm. Looks good. Okay, we have put the apples into four dessert bowls and now we're going to make the topping. So for the topping we're going to use two bananas and like half a cup of yogurt to make the topping. We're putting the bananas into the pot. So two Let's add about a tablespoon of water so that the bananas don't burn and wait till they get soft and mushy and then you take them off the pan and put some yogurt in with them. Okay, it's nice and mushy now. See? And you've just got to cook it a little bit longer till the bits of banana get softened. Then you'll see. Blended the bananas into a nice mushy pate. Your finished goo should look like this. Nice and creamy, banana y. And, yes. Okay, we're just gonna take a spoon and mix it. A nice creamy, banana y texture. And we're just going to mix it so the cold air can get in. And yeah, now we just have to let it cool for about five, six, seven minutes. Pour some plain yogurt on top of the stewed apples. And we're just waiting for the banana mix to cool. And then we'll put that on top. And now for the finishing touch, we're just going to put one almond on top of each of them. And they're done. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good. Interesting mixture. Mm -hmm. But it tastes good. That's what matters. Um.
Who had this yesterday? Well, we didn't have that many ingredients. We finished the sugar packet. Oh, less sugar. <laughs> um. So, subscribe. Um. And when you make this dessert, enjoy. Um. Send some ideas for other desserts. Simple. Mhm. Mm um. Bye.